You are listening to the Catholic Family Podcast, Lent Around the World, daily meditations chosen and read by traditional Catholics from around the globe. Hello everyone, my name is Guillaume von Heisel, I am a French citizen from Strasbourg in Alsace, and today I will read some excerpt from Pope Benedict XIV's Non Ambiguous, an encyclical letter about the importance of Lent in the Catholic religion. Quote, we have no doubt, venerable brethren, that those who adhere to the Catholic religion know how much the Church, which has spread throughout the Christian world, consider it essential to include the Lenten fast among the bulwark of true doctrine. This period, that is, the time of Lent, first outlined in the Law and in the Prophets, consecrated by the example of our Lord Jesus Christ, transmitted by the Apostles, prescribed everywhere, in all the sacred canons, was accepted and observed by the whole Church from its very beginnings. It is certain that with the help of this remedy, bequeathed by the ancient fathers to us who sin daily, we too, joined to the cross of Christ, will be able to make use of what he has given us and thus purified by fasting in body and soul, we prepare ourselves to commemorate in a more meritorious way the sacred mysteries of redemption by the remembrance of the Passion and the Resurrection, which are celebrated with the greatest solemnity, especially during Lent. The observance of Lent is the bond of our militia. It is by it that we distinguish ourselves from the enemies of the cross of Jesus Christ. It is through it that the scourges of divine anger depart. It is by it that, protected by heavenly help during the day, we fortify ourselves against the princes of darkness. If this observance were to be relaxed, it would be to the detriment of the glory of God, to the dishonor of the Catholic religion and to the peril of Christian souls, and without doubt this negligence would become the source of misfortunes for people, of disasters in public affairs, of misfortunes for individuals. How foreign, how different, how opposite is the attitude of he who, on the contrary, abstains from all respect for the most holy Lent and for the other days dedicated to fasting, days deeply rooted in the hearts of all Catholics. How deviant such an attitude is from the true doctrine of fasting and from the practices observed at all times, everywhere and by all. <laughs>